Hey beautiful people, it's your girl Mimi Shosley Mimi again. Welcome back guys and thanks for staying tuned to my channel. Okay guys, so you know in my last video I posted where Yvonne, Olivia and um, Jenny O and Nana were saying some little bit trash about the, their housemates, their fellow South African housemates. Okay, so not quite long. Yaya came to join them as if she perceived that in them because it's as if they're isolating themselves like people don't want to mix up with them you understand so it's as if Yaya perceived that and Yaya went to meet them do you understand and Yaya went to meet them look at this picture as, as you can see through this picture you will see the disdain on their faces you will see the disdain on their faces so let's get to see what people get to say about it okay guys Ade Jumoke said, you know the truth, the truth is if someone is feeling insecure, they, pro they project that to how people act around them, who they want to relate with, blah blah blah. This was a good opportunity for the girls to gain exposure by relating to people from different cultures and oh, it's just so sad to see this segregation. It is indeed so sad to see this segregation, I must say, because when Yaya walked up to them, do you understand, it is clear for them to get to even know her. Do you understand? It's not keeping that face because of what they already have in mind. So Lala V5 said, These girls need to put effort because this is wrong and sad to watch. They don't want to talk to people, but when people come to talk to them, they start having weird faces. Chai, this is so sad to watch. What Yaya did was so sweet. You know, that was what I was trying to say. That you don't, like, you think people don't, don't, don't want to approach you. You misunderstood people, and I don't even know what they feel, what their mindset was, because I can't even relate with them. But Yaya came and they not give him attention. See their faces as he did, like what Oroko. Queen Yaya said Olivia face couldn't even hide the disdain towards Yaya, even walking away. Yes, their face was so like so mean that Olivia was felt irritated and she walked away from that discussion. I know Yaya could perceive this. If she is sharp, she should perceive this this um mood, this their uh, mindset. Harab said, when two of them get evicted, they will know the house is meant for games and bonding with different cultures. They can do better. This scene is actually, there is a reason why this scene is meant for South African and Nigerians. It is for us to get to get bond more, not to segregate, please. So guys, let me go to the love matter. This just people. So people have been saying that um, um, Ilepeng and uh, Tabang approached Kosi. Yeah, they approached Kosi. They were telling Kosi that that the that they felt it cozy thought that Yemi don't relate to other housemates, that they don't relate to other housemates. Do you understand? And they don't find it cool. They feel they should get to spend less time together and that and that, blah, blah, blah. Do you understand that they think um Kossi should give their um, friendship with Yemi a break so that they will get to know other housemates? And Kossi ended up saying thank you. So let's see how people react towards that, okay? Mavis Ice Queen Matundi said they are jealous. Kosi and Yemi does not spend much time together. We are watching. You cannot call that jealousy. You cannot say that is jealousy because they confronted them. It's not a backbiting kind of thing. Luka Mandla said, but Yemi talks, sits and have conversation with everybody. Now he is sleeping. Did Kosi tell him to sleep and not talk to others? And Kosi is not after him all the time. To me, I feel they are not. I feel they have space to do whatever they want to do. That's why you get to see Yemi with different ladies. You see Yemi with Yvonne today. See Yemi with this one tomorrow. So I think they are free. And Kossi is not stopping anything. But you know, housemates are there. They are watching. They have what they see. And they have the right to advise their fellow housemates. So far, they are not saying it behind their back. Where me, I have issues with saying things behind people's back. Okay, and come to the front and pretend better person. So Delzi Ying said, Chiboeze said, they are in the house with them, so they see a lot than we viewers. They have some good points. Isolating themselves from the from the other housemates is not a good strategy. Yeah, just like what I said initially, that they are in the house seeing everything together. So they have a reason why they said so. Even if they don't, they know why they said so. So it's cool. It, the advice is cool. So far, they say it to their faces, okay? So, Kosi Twala said, Kosi sat there and took constructive criticism from Ipeleng and didn't take offense whatsoever and eventually agreed with her to an extent. She is real and rare. Yes, she is. Like, taking it in, telling them thank you, guys, you know? And she stepped out. 
That's one thing with life. Oh, people will tend to advise, now you know what's in good for you and the right thing for you. So guys, the housemate is preparing for their wager tax and they, they will present it today, I think in the evening. So do you think they have, they've tried? Do you think they was the 75% wager that they are talking the wager? Do you think they will win or do you think they will lose this wager? Do you think the housemates prepared very well for this wager or do you think they, they were less prepared or do you think they, they took it for granted? What do you think about this? I would like to know in the comment section, please. So, but let's see what other people have to say about this wager. Okay. Fifalo said, imagine all the sleepless nights for a loss. It's going to be a long week. Away. Ah, Fifalo Frangel. Why will you now say that now? Why you go to say they go fail their wager? That was harsh. Oh, hmm. But if you ask me, should I say my own? No, I will not say own. Let's keep reading. <laughs> so, Rahab said, looking forward to them losing it. Need violence next week. Ha, ha, comrade. Comrade, calm down. Oh, calm down. Now, what for you? Sincerely, if they lose, it's going to be hurt for them. <laughs> okay. So, Chimwasi said, I can't wait for today's wager presentation. I'm looking forward to hear my guys sing. Justin and Ebubu. Uh -huh. Your guys a wave now. What for us when we get guys to oh, tie? Okay, but yes, we, we are looking forward to the presentation. Actually, we want to see what the housemate got, we want to hear and see and enjoy it and feel it. You get mm -hmm. Let's see the next one. Mata Tossi said, The headache I have right now because of this song. No. This is torture. Can they stop now and carry on tomorrow? Big brother, tell them to go sleep now. Nah, I beg. <laughs> what do you mean, Mata? What do you mean? Come on. The aspects are trying now. <laughs> Can you see? <laughs> As it even before the major preparation, I don't love Taya. Okay. Um, happiness, Owele said. Queen Lee said. Biggie, just give Justin all next week, bros. Gorgeous. He deserved them. Haha, <laughs> uh -huh. this one I just seen love out. Okay, he actually he was trying. Now, this one said, I am gonna have nightmares today. I'm traumatized. This song, sorry, patient said so. Hmm, you're traumatized. Can you sing? Okay, more blessings said they should let Justin sing for them. The guy is doing better than everyone, he is a diamond in a rough. Oh, I love this compliment. He is a diamond in a rough that rings a bell in my head it, this this is so sweet someone being a diamond in a rough Aww. the next one please generally this housemate need music lessons some go total some go totally off key jokies are now wow for you <laughs> oh my god um shabin betty said i don't think they win this wager task with that energy and attitude hmm if you ask me now, who I go ask? Well, I wanted to say something, but let me not say my own, okay? Before you we say, I want them to fail. But at all, I say, Piggy understand this housemates are no musician, but their dedication to the task may get them win the wager. So, how is their dedication? Are they trying? Are they putting efforts? And sis, are they putting efforts? Do you think they are really trying? Or do you think it's just some few persons that are trying? Okay, we'll get to see that tonight if they're gonna win or lose their wager. Okay, so guys, this is the gist for now. Okay, stay tuned. You no, know, don't relax. So don't even blink because I'm coming back. I'm coming right back. Okay, don't forget to subscribe, like, and share my video, and also feel free to comment. Okay, bye for now, and please turn on your notification bell. Very important. Kisses, guys. Mwah.